Hello, 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 Lisa Zimmer here. Hello. All right, let's see how everyone's doing today. Fix my shirt, my shirt won't stay put. All right, it was really terrible lighting today. I don't know what's going on. It's really dark. It's nice out even. All right, let's see who's gonna join us. Comment when you hop on so I know it's working. I'm trying to go live today from my computer. So if I get an update on promotions for next month, I can share them with you. I thought I'd have an update by now. Okay, say hi when you come on. Oh, yeah. Hi, Heather. Yay, it's working. Okay. Beep, 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 beep. Hi, Carla. Hi, Maria. And seven others. Say hi when you come on so I know who's here. I want to do some giveaways today. I don't know what yet, but I got a whole bin of goodies in the other room. So I'm going to give Heather and Maria and Carla and Faye, the first four to comment on my side. I say my side because it shows me different things than what you guys see. Oh my goodness, it's going too fast. I can't even screenshot it fast enough to prove that who was on first. Okay, so the names I just called off, I think it was Heather, Maria, Carla, and Faye. Let's add Dawn Lily to that. Um, I'm write those down super fast. We're gonna do some giveaways for you. That's Heather, Maria, Faye, Dawn, Carla. All right, the first five people that commented on my side. Sorry, I took a pic just to make sure. Um, I have some presents for you to pick from. I'm gonna have some roller blends, some oil trays. Um, I'll just go through the list one at a time and send them to you through Messenger. And let me make sure I have it. Heather Price, Maria. All right, I wanna hear what you wanna learn about today. What do you wanna learn about today? I'm gonna talk about my favorite oil shots. I am really big on the oil shots lately. Plus, hopefully in the next little bit, doTERRA will tell us what next month's promos are. If not, I'll post them as soon as I find out. But I'm super excited they're launching something in August. I know it's not even July yet, but hi, Anita. I miss you too. Um, Anita wants to learn about ear health. Yay, let's talk about that. All right, so ear health, some good oil shots, because that's my topic today to do. Um, lemon, lavender, peppermint, um, oils that help with sinuses, because um, that directly affects your ears. Oils that are great for around your ears. How do we know what to use, right? I just go to my book. I don't care what book. Go pick a book. Diane says, what do you use to replace hair glaze? Oh, I got links for that. I am testing them all, let me tell you. And I have found a winner, winner, chicken dinner. I have been using one that I like, and then that company came out with another one that I love. And it works well with my doTERRA leave-in conditioner. So Diane said, what do you use to replace hair, the doTERRA hair glaze? So I'll send that to you privately. Um, okay, so let's talk about ears. So the first thing I'm going to do is go to my book, and in the front or back, depending on the book, there's always, like, um, I forget what it's called, index, and so I'm going to look in the index, and anything ear-related, all right, anything ear-related, you're going to see similar oils regardless of what ear support it needs, right? So tea tree helichrysum, basil, lavender, rosemary, on guard, thyme, cedarwood, and clove. 
that covers every ear topic possible. All right, so I use oils around my ears every single day. I always have had lumps behind my ears that get bigger and smaller. I don't know if they're limp or whatever they are. All right, I've had that forever. So I use tea tree every single day around my ears. I had a horrible ringing in my ears um, after uh, taking the Levaquin and then after my cataract surgery and humming and it sounded like air airplane propellers and I used tea tree, helichrysum, basil, tea tree, helichrysum, basil, and lavender around my ears. That's something you can just use every day proactively. And uh, Stacy says, recently pierced my upper ear, the cartilage is still sore. So I would get tea tree on that right away and um, helichrysum and lavender. That would be fantastic. Maria says she uses uh, Maluka tea tree around the ears. So oil shots, why the oil shots? Because um, we want to help your body have a healthy inflammatory response. We want to make sure that isn't causing um, an issue. My computer says too low FPS. The current frame rate is too low. Please set the frame rate to 15 to 60 FPS or viewers may experience a lower quality stream. Yeah, like I know what that means. Or how to do it. <laughs> you got to love technology. I don't know what it means. Can you guys see me and hear me? That's all I care about. All right, so ear health. So tea tree, heel chrysum, basil, lavender. That's a great roller to make. You can make a 10 milliliter roller and put 10 drops each. Tea tree, heel chrysum, basil, lavender. Um, and you can always add frankincense. Um, frankincense is back on my radar to making sure I'm using it every single day. Had some really mind-blowing testimonials about a frankincense. So um, I wanna make sure that we're talking about all the ways we can use our frank, especially today. All right, so my newest gig is my cute little cup from Tokyo. This is a little shot glass. I think it's for espresso. It's from the Starbucks Reserve Roastery. It was this massive, like, three- or four-story Starbucks. It was incredible. Anyway, this is my shot glass that stays on my counter. It's important that something like this stays on my counter because I'm visually reminded um, to use my products. So I have to keep finding new tips and tricks and change it up a little bit so that it jogs my memory to do what I want to do. So um, this last week I have this on my counter and frankincense and lime. So every time after I eat I get a little froggy in my throat. I have something sinusy and um, I want to keep that um, at bay. And then frankincense, I have fallen off the wagon with frankincense on my tongue. I'm going to take a picture of this too low FPS and have my darling son um, figure out what that means for me later. Okay. Tell me in the comments if, oh, Becky says the quality is fine. Yay. Okay. Thanks. Um, frankincense in and on our bodies every single day. I already get it on my body. Right now I have my body spray on and you guys all know my body spray. Frankincense, lavender, tea tree, peppermint, copaiba, vanilla, Madagascar vanilla. Um, 20 to 40 drops each depending on how strong you like it in a four ounce um, sprayer. I double the vanilla, maybe triple it, and I definitely double or triple the peppermint. Okay, it helps keep my body cool right now because it's hotter than Hades here. Okay, frankincense on my tongue. Don't love the taste, all right? And I get kind of over it after a while, okay? So that's why I fell off the wagon. In a shot, do I have water? Yeah, I have water. So I just take my shot glass. In for one drop, two is fine. It comes out pretty fast. Take the excess, put it on my wrist, rub my wrists together and smell. I want the internal benefits, I want the topical benefits, and I want the aromatic benefits of my frankincense. And we're going to read a little bit from the book so I can remind you of how powerful it is. The lime I'm using for sinus support. 
And remember, citrus oils high in limonene help your body naturally produce glutathione, right? So Google the benefits of glutathione. I'm going to read a little bit about that for you. Let's go to frankincense. I've been reading a lot about Lyme because everybody's got these seasonal issues right now. And lime is a huge helper. Drink it in your water all day. Frankincense. And um, my water blend that I keep telling you about in every video is right now lime, lemon, grapefruit, tangerine. The reason I keep telling you about some of the same recipes over and over and over and over and over is repetition, repetition, repetition equals retention, retention, retention. If you're like me, you have to hear something quite a few times before you take action on it. Um, so frankincense, we know for overall health from head to toe. It helps your body create apoptosis. Google the benefits of apoptosis. Uh, it helps your body maintain a healthy inflammatory response. Tri-Ease is back in stock. I'm surprised I didn't get a team app notification about that. Uh, my phone's still on. They're a little behind today. So Tri-Ease, lemon, lavender, peppermint, pre-made soft gels. Stock up on that for sinus support. All right. Frankincense. Um, scars so frankincense is going on my skin cancer surgery scar I use it every day in the form of immortelle now I had fallen off the wagon about that and um, where my scar is I can't actually see it and so I forget about it because I'm a visual person so um, it hurt a little bit one day um, there's a little bump under it I think another <laughs> internal stitch is trying to come out so that reminded me to get back on the wagon about that so frankincense or immortelle with frankincense in it. Then I've also been taking my leftover hydrating cream, my doTERRA hydrating cream. And you know I add frank, five drops frankincense, tea tree, and pure rose oil to it and stir it in. Um, any leftover on my fingers, I've been rubbing on my scar as well. All right. Um, liver health, sad feelings, anxious feelings, inflammatory response, wrinkles. We're talking frankincense. Um, healthy breathing, sinuses, breast health, vaginal health, uterine health, skin health. Emotionally, it helps you to go from feeling separated to unified. Nearly all religions have used frankincense in their spiritual practices, including ancient Egyptians, Greeks, Romans, Christians, Jews, Muslims, Hindus, and Buddhists. All right, it's restorative. It's great for anything skin. It's great for head to toe health. It can do things that we're not allowed to talk about. So get your frankincense. Um, Christine is using Frank right now um, for some bruising from a knee surgery she had two weeks ago. So a reminder, Christine, to make sure you're using tea tree and oregano around any um, sutures. The number one cause of um, issues for orthopedic surgeons for knee surgery is post-operative infection. Um, that's the number one issue. I'm sure they gave you antibiotics and that's great. You want to take those of course um, post-knee surgery and then um, to heighten those benefits um, do a roller 20 drops tea tree 20 drops oregano and roll around um, that area uh, morning and night to help keep that uh, strong and healthy. All right, um, puffy red around eye. Well, puffy around eye, we can use our cypress, cypress oil that we got free last week from Bogos. Um, Diane said she saw what is coming soon. Well, maybe you can tell me because um, I haven't gotten it yet. I know one thing that's coming soon and um, it comes out August 1st and I'm super excited about it. And um, those of us that share uh, doTERRA with others and have reached the rank of silver or above are going to get to try it first. So I'm very excited um, about that honor and privilege. They're doing that so we can use the product first, um, get uh, used to how we're going to use it, and give you some great ideas. So I'm super excited. 
Right. Uh, oh, I'm so happy, Christine, that you came on today. So share, share, share. Um, yep, the rose oil and moringa oil are coming out in Canada. I'm waiting for confirmation for the U.S. All right, let's see what else you guys are asking about. Lime is great in a cherry smoothie. You can put lime oil in beer. I recommend any citrus oil in your alcoholic beverages. I use grapefruit because it's great for the liver, right? It helps keep my liver clear and um, I don't get any kind of a hangover. Now, I don't drink enough anymore to get a hangover. Um, the most I drink is, um, worst case scenario, three drinks over like a four to five hour period. Um, but even that is um, rare. All right, let's see. Tulsi holy basil is great for ear health. Anita, you are correct. Tea tree, helichrysum, lavender, and basil. All right, looks like I got through all those. Okay, so my next, um, this is not oil shot. This is a diffuser blend I brought in that I want to remind people about, but I'm going to add one of the oils to my oil shot. So right now my oil shot has frankincense and lime. This has been in my diffuser all week, Siberian fir and grapefruit. Um, I want to read about the benefits of uh, Siberian fir because it's been a little while. I'm going to take my shot glass. I'm going to do a couple drops of grapefruit, pour a little bit of water in there. Not much, I don't need much. I do it a few times. You can add this to your MetaPower drink if you're doing the. Um, Oh, we've called it so many things, but um, your MetaPower drinks, all I call it. So my MetaPower drink is one packet of Advantage. That's the collagen plus NMN. It's helping with hair growth, eyebrow growth, um, eyelash growth. All my eyelashes I tore out when I ripped off my fake lashes, like, I don't know, five months ago, something like that. My eyelashes help grown back stronger, longer, thicker, definitely longer than they ever have in my entire life. So I attribute that to Advantage Collagen plus NMN and PB Restore and one drop rosemary, one drop lavender back in my mascara. Okay, great for eye growth. You can also use the Zimmer Hair Growth Spray on a mascara wand and put it on your eyebrows or put it on your fingers and put it on your eyebrows. That helps your eyebrows grow back. Um, so my MetaPower drink is the MetaPower Advantage Collagen, the MetaPower Electrolytes um, filled with magnesium and my body is taking that great. Um, I'm very sensitive to magnesium so I have to be careful with that. And then one packet of the PB Assist Powder Sachet. It's amazing. It tastes great. Um, drink 20, 22 ounces, something like that, and drink it all very quickly. July 1st in the U.S. Uh, Sharon, what is July 1st in the U.S.? Come on, guys, give me some details. I don't know what you guys are saying. Um, Diane says, beer isn't good for your liver, but lime is. Yep, I don't drink beer. <laughs> yep, yeah, I totally agree. Liza says, when you miss mentioned sinuses it made me think to add a drop of frankincense in the neti pot because I already use tea tree when I rinse my sinuses although I probably don't do it enough yep so saline um, I'll leave it up to you on oils in the neti pot I did that once and it burned so bad I was like I felt like my brain was on fire so um but if you do that yay for you you are one strong woman all right looks like some of you already know about the promos before they've been announced so, um, all right. I never announce them until I get them direct from corporate in case something changes um, from our uh, leader meeting to the announcement. Yes, make sure you're ordering MetaPower Recharge. That's the electrolytes. MetaPower um, Advantage is the collagen powder packet. I'm all into the packets now. I'm loving all the packets. Um, Rosa Moringa coming July 1st. Okay, well, I'm going to wait. 
um, until I get it in writing from corporate because every time I announce something before we actually get in writing from them, it ends up not making it or the shipment um, didn't arrive in time or it arrived damaged or so I'm going to wait. All right, but if the Moringa Rose and Rose Hydrosol comes, you're going to want to load up because it's not going to be around for long. We are all so obsessed um, with that set. Um, I spray it all over my face. I put the Moringa oil on my face, all over my chest. I've been putting the Moringa oil on my legs, on my scar. I'm completely obsessed with skin health right now. Julia says, our house recently had a stomach bug. The recharge was very helpful for our recovery. <clears throat> yes, we're supposed to be able to get the um, rose hydrosol and the moringa oil separately this time. So I'm really excited about that. Uh, remember, it's amazing for skin health. Okay, rose is super calming as well. So it's really good to use before bedtime. Um, all right. My computer's saying I need to close some of the windows I have open. I only have one window open. <laughs> My computer hates me today. All right, so I did my oil shot. I can still see some residual oil in there. So I'm gonna keep um, pouring water in and keep drinking that until I've gotten all the oil out. All right, this is frankincense, lime, and grapefruit. The lime and grapefruit are great for my liver. Lime is great for the colon. I've been dealing with some digestive stuff thanks to um, parasites and doing a detox for that, which has really affected my mood, having some anger issues, frustration, um, overwhelm, not feeling settled. Fortunately, I've gotten to know my body and my mind well enough that I know it is simply the side effects of detoxing and because when the parasites die, they release, release toxins, all right? So I'm taking my activated char charcoal. I'm taking my Zendocrine um, detoxification complex to go along with my parasite cleanse. I'm taking GX Assist to help support my body and keep my immune system strong. Um, and I'm using diatomaceous earth and activated charcoal um, and then working with uh, my doctor on that right so love 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 that we have options to support our body it's very important for me to take the electrolytes and the advantage collagen during my cleanse right to help my body stay hydrated all right what else was I gonna look up oh Siberian fur I wanted to talk about why I'm using Siberian fur in my diffuser one I forget to use it um, and two, I am a huge fan of the tree oils, all right? So Siberian fur is great for bones. It's great for um, urinary health, circulation, sluggish digestion, liver, liver health. So I want that. I'm diffusing it. Um, I have a little spray bottle of Siberian fur and grapefruit. It just smells good. I love the way it smells. Oh, and hormone balancing. So Siberian fur for hormone balancing. Uh, brain fog, I've had some of that. And diffusing the Siberian fur and grapefruit is cleansing the air. It's very cleansing to the air. Emotional balance, it helps you to go from feeling excluded to empowered. And I am needing that desperately. I have had um, trouble meeting people in Florida that I connect with. Um, not as many natural health and wellness minded people down here um, as I'm used to. Um, not as many um, people into taking care of themselves as I'm used to. <laughs> not as many people that like to talk about the same things that I like to talk about. So um, the Siberian fur is helping to support my emotions um, through some of this. How is the being Siberian good for the bones I don't know how to answer that I don't know <laughs> but it's good for your bones so you apply it um, topically to your bones it helps strengthen them 
can help repair them. So I don't know scientifically how it works, but you can Google how is Siberian fur essential oil good for bones and it'll pop up for you because I'm so limited on the things that I can say. All right, let me go back to my checklist and make sure that I'm covering the things I want to cover. It's so weird they haven't sent the update. All right, um, let's see. Hopefully everybody got their free blue lotus. I want to hear how many of you got your free blue lotus. And um, what products have I used this last week? I've been using a lot. Oh, I'm really loving the leave-in conditioner. I'm absolutely loving the leave-in conditioner. And then I put my new glaze that I got from another company because we don't have one um, over the top. And it's helped my hair tremendously. Oh, love your liver roller. So I'm going to harp on that every video. Um, I recently learned why blue tansy is the important ingredient in the love your liver roller. It helps open the uh, liver bile duct. I was listening to a podcast on YouTube about, um, or a podcast about um, uh, parasite cleansing and using herbs or essential oils or whatnot. And this chiropractor is really big into herbs, and um, but he mentioned that he loves to use blue tansy over the liver every single day. And um, so that was pretty awesome. And then he explained how beneficial it is for the liver. So love your liver roller, 10 drops each, adaptive, blue tansy, citrus bloom, geranium, zendocrine, and optional is Litzy if you have it. If you do not, you can add an Air X that has Litzy in it. Top your 10 milliliter roller with fractionated coconut oil and roll over your liver generously. All right, so I always want to talk about that one. Um, I'm becoming a big fan of castor oil. You're probably hearing about it a lot lately. Um, I don't put it in my hair recipe. A lot of people like to use it in their hair. It's too sticky and gooey and thick for me, and I don't want to wash my hair every day. I have massaged a little bit here in these... Um, spots that are always thinner. Mine are not thinner anymore. In fact, they used to go way back. Um, the PB Restore, the probiotic big dog, um, is really making my hair grow like crazy. I got my Blue Lotus. Where'd it go? No telling. My office is a disaster. Um, someone said to me, do you know why I love you so much or like you so much? And it made me cry instantly when she said that. She said, because you're so real. Um, Eileen, if you look at the last couple of videos, I post the recipes, the favorite recipes, um, at the top of, in the words of every video. You can also just type liver in the search bar, and it pops up because I talk about it pretty much every video. So I'm keeping it real today, folks. I got stuff all over the place. My office is trashed. So I have finally learned that I cannot have stuff on my kitchen counter when the day is done, no matter how hard I've worked out there, um, because it stresses me out and makes me feel overwhelmed and behind. And so I just have to scoop up whatever work I got going on and um, I dump it in my office. <laughs> so my poor beautiful office. My assistant's gonna come back from her one week vacation and be like, what happened? We had it all fixed. <laughs> life, life happened. All right, so if it makes you feel better to have a room um, of crap everywhere and the rest of your house looking good, you have my permission to do that. I am now giving myself permission to do that. So um, it's usually my closet. I read in my closet. It's immaculate. I'm going to keep it that way because I love it and it's making me feel good. The rest of the house is looking amazing. I went room by room by room and started cleaning. I got spring fever or something. Um, the garage is next. It's a disaster. But I give you permission to declutter and I give you permission to have one space of clutter if that's what you need because stuff just always keeps coming in. It's like, where does all this paper come from, right? Um, but we need to declutter our spaces and declutter our minds a little bit. And so I need this one disastrous space um, for all the extra stuff so I can clear out the 
declutter and relax. Um, I have not been doing a good job of relaxing. I am not good at it, period. Um, have not been since my divorce. I stopped watching TV altogether. I picked up watching TV again with all the travel um, because I needed to download something on Netflix to make the 20 some hour um, travel day to Japan and back. I think it ended up being 30 some hours on the way back. And um, started watching Sex in the City and watched that and I was like, now what, all right? Well, TV helps me relax because it keeps my mind occupied. Um, if my mind is not occupied, I'm not able to relax. So I am working on clearing the clutter in my home. I'm working on clearing the clutter in my oils biz, which is why um, Heather, Maria, Faye, Don, and Carla are all going to win prizes for coming on and commenting first. Um, I'm going to clear some oil goodies and share with you all. In fact, you guys will be really excited if you're all in the U.S., I, I think most of you are, um, you're going to get something that nobody else has. All right, you are seriously going to um, want to uh, make sure you're showing up for the lives because I've got some products that you can't get anywhere else. So when I went to Japan, I bought some goodies to share with y'all. So winners are going to get a packet of a product from Japan called Fossil, and it's uh, 70 plus minerals. The only way to get it is through the Japan market, so you cannot get your hands on it. But those lovely ladies, um, if you pick um, uh, a prize to be sent to you versus something from my website, you're gonna get um, a package of Fossil from Japan. So, very cool. All right, um, what else do we want to talk about today? I want to hear what problems you're having that we can work on together. Super excited um, about what is coming out for next month. Again, I just want to confirm that it definitely is before I make any promises. I hope you all got your travel kit. I'm obsessed. I'm not only obsessed with what's in it, but I'm so obsessed with this bag. I'm a bag girl. My friend Chris gets it. We just collect bags. Um, Diane, it is, um, I did not get the liquid drink fossil. I got um, the fossil in the packet so that I can um, send them. So I tell you what, um, there's only a couple products different in Japan. Uh, this fossil drink, it comes in powder form and liquid form. It's their number one product. Um, they have the hydrating cream, but they also have, I forget what it's called. It's like magical night cream or something. Whoa, we have got to find a way to get them to make it for the U.S. It has helped so much. I'm assuming because the Japanese culture wants the lighter skin. They use umbrellas all day, sunscreen, hats. They do not get tan. And um, my skin the next day, my age spots and discolorations are so much lighter. So um, it is jam-packed with frankincense. When you open that jar, that's another reason I want to talk about frankincense today. I forgot. When you, I forget how powerful our frankincense is until I see it in action. Um, I didn't see a slim and sassy firming lotion um, when I was there. So I'm not sure about that, Jennifer. So, um, but yes, I'm going to read through the ingredients. I got to get my Google Translator because all my packaging is in Japanese, of course. Um, but frankincense, 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 all right? Um, I highly recommend, yes, <laughs> Sharon says, so you're saying we'll all need to plan trips to Japan. Yes, yes, and yes, and take an entire suitcase. They allowed me to use my points. I got to check out right at the counter. I got to see and try every product. It was crazy. Um... So I highly recommend a trip to Japan. It was the greatest thing I've ever done, um, especially going with my son. It was the best two weeks of my life. Ten days would have been plenty. We did not need two weeks because we did not travel uh, much outside of Tokyo. If you want to travel to other places like Kyoto, um, Okinawa, wherever, Mount Fuji, um, take a little more time. Jax and I loved it so much, we're actually going to go back either at Christmas or in May. So, we're saving our pennies. Um, okay, I'm not saving my pennies. I'm cutting costs. And my bracelet just broke. I'm cutting costs and 
other areas of my life so that I can travel. So I am so excited. I'm going to be going to Argentina in August, the end of August. And um, so I would love any tips um, from you for Argentina. There's another pair of that bracelet away. What a major bummer. Beautiful bracelet. Um, so I'm going to Buenos Aires for the Tango Festival and to learn more. So if any of you are from um, Argentina or have friends there or um, do doTERRA there, uh, let me know because we're going to go, my doTERRA uh, leader and I are going to go check it out and mark Argentina off my travel list, right? So um, recently, I think I've covered this before, but someone was talking about how bad the economy is. And it's fascinating, right? Yeah, the economy is bad. Uh, people choose what to pour themselves into um, in these situations. I'm pouring my budget into my health and wellness, physically and mentally. And a couple areas I'm not cutting is um, my doTERRA, right? I buy more and more doTERRA every single month because I learn more and more about what a mistake it is when I fall off the wagon. And I'm not doing that anymore. Uh, my mental health and my physical health is too important to me. It doesn't matter what the economy is. If I'm not healthy, it doesn't matter if I have money or don't have money. Um, I need the travel for my mental health. I need to see how other parts of the world live and be introduced to new ways of thinking and living and to feel fulfilled, right? So um, I continue to cut in other places. I'm doing meal planning. Jax and I have eaten tacos since Tuesday. Um, we made Tuesday Taco Tuesday. I put a super cheap roast in a crock pot with some um, organic chicken broth or stock or whatever and um, we turn around and we make our own tacos and um, we have leftovers for lunch and we're saving so that we can go out to eat and do something special and other than that we're eating at home we're cutting 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 in areas that don't improve our quality of life right one of the other things I've done is I got back to having a cleaning lady once a month, um, right? That is a, a small amount of money for something that's very important to me, right? I'm running multiple businesses all by myself. I'm traveling the world to grow my businesses as well as for my mental health. And um, there are areas I need to cut, all right? So, but one of them is never going to be my doTERRA because again, without my physical and emotional health, What's the point? All right, so you gotta figure out what works for you and we gotta stop falling off the wagon and we gotta stop making excuses, all right? So uh, I wanna give you, let me just rattle off my top 10 products right now so you can put them on your list. My top 10 products for every day. I gotta look up because I have to think about what I do every day, right? The Zendocrin Love Your Liver Roller that I make, my recipe that I read off, my Digestin Roller, 20 Drops Digestin, 20 Drops DDR Prime, 20 Drops Arbor Vita. Fell off the wagon with that, which is probably why, um, you know, my parasites went crazy. And, um, see, I wake up. Uh, hydrating Cream. Gosh, I'm going to do way more than 10. All right, my... Um, I want these to be the 10 that I literally can't live without. Cardamom in my diffuser at bedtime. My oils in my coffee, my oils in my water. LLB, PB Restore, Terrazyme, Advantage Collagen, Advantage Recharge Electrolytes, PB Assist Plus, Zendocrine Complex, Digestin Soft Gels, Peppermint Soft Gels. Boy, it is really hard to get down to a minimum, right? Isn't it? Once you realize, oh, an adaptive. Oh, my goodness. Adaptive in my diffuser every day is keeping me sane. All right. I want to read some of your comments quick, and then we'll wrap up. All right. Um, yeah. 
if you have the opportunity to go to Japan, you have to go to Japan. All right, let's see. Becky says she puts a drop of frankincense under her tongue every morning. Yes, yes, yes. All right, oh, and then of course frankincense. Um, I forget how amazing even using the oils internally are for calming my nervous system and my brain. I have an overactive brain. I have a very um, antagonized nervous system ever since I took that antibiotic. Um, I literally can feel like I'm buzzing and vibrating uh, at times. And I also learned that that can also be from parasites. Interesting, all right? And um, life's been hard. And so the frankincense and lime, so frankincense and a citrus, um, frankincense and wild orange, frankincense and lemon, frankincense and tangerine, frankincense and lime, um, so good for calming. I had one of the most relaxing days I've had in a long time. I had to forgive myself and say, you know what, you're going to be unproductive today. You're taking the day off. I don't, I'm not very good at taking any time off. Um, even when I'm traveling, I'm working. Um, thanks to these phones. Um, I love helping you, but sometimes you just got to shut the world out and watch a movie and listen to some spa music and take a bath and get a massage. And um, sometimes you just have to do those things, right? Figure out where you can cut. Other things I've done is I started selling stuff. I had a Rolex that I never wore from a while back. Sold it. Took the hit. Sold it want my doTERRA and I want to travel. Had a purse that I didn't use anymore and um, sold it. So little by little, I'm going through the home and finding things. If, it, if I look at it and it causes me stress or anxiety, I'm getting rid of it. I'm either donating it, selling it, whatever I have to do, even if it is not the best financial decision, it's the best, best emotional decision to Keep clearing the clutter. Heather says, I will never cut doTERRA. It has helped us so much. I know, right? It hurts my heart so much when people around me um, continue to complain about their health or lack of energy or stomach problems or whatever um, and refuse to try. Whatever you're doing hasn't been working. Um considering how um, those particular topics are ones that I have successfully accomplished for myself and so many people. It's really painful when people don't listen. It hurts my heart a lot. Trish, Trisha says she started making healthy gummy bears. She uses one pack of Advantage, one pack Recharge, half a cup water, one and a half tablespoons further food gelatin. She heats the water, adds in the Recharge and Advantage, then the gelatin, and a few drops of natural sweetener. She puts them in her gummy tray with a baster and puts it in the fridge. She pulls them out and keeps them in a Ziploc. That's brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. I love that. Heather says she loves the adaptive pills. They have helped greatly for any situation that might cause her to be upset or not feel calm. She carries the roller bottle everywhere. Me too. So I got the roller bottle here. I got the roller bottle in my purse. I take Adaptive, Calmer, Tea Tree, and Digestin in my purse everywhere I go. Oh, and I just found my little rose, neroli, and magnolia, little mini ones. So I threw those in there as well. All right. Um, uh, Dawn says, I shy away from products with rosemary and thyme due to blood pressure. Does anyone else need to do that? Um, that is person by person. So if um, your uh, blood pressure does not respond well to using those oils, then definitely eliminate them. Faye says, your skin looks amazing. Okay, so there's no filter on this at all. None whatsoever. Um, and it's even really, really bad lighting. So thank you for saying that. Um, you get brownie points, Faye, for saying my skin looks amazing with this um, really, really bad lighting. Um, so castor oil, I'm using castor oil packs. I put, um, I rub castor oil over my liver and put like a 
t-shirt because it's going to get stained or I have a little cloth that I got um, from Amazon with the castor oil. So I wear the castor oil packs at night. I put castor oil in my belly button at night and then I put castor oil in my belly button when I wake up. Last night before bed, knowing that it was going to stain my sheets and stain my pillowcase, I put castor oil all over my face. I did my hydrating cream and all that after I got out of the bath. So it was probably like an hour later. I did the castor oil all over my face. I massaged it. I knew I was going to wash my hair today. So I massaged it in these parts here. I made sure it was on my eyebrows and I massaged it into my eyelashes. It's great for growing hair. It's great for amazing skin. I put it all over my neck. I put it all over my chest. I put it over my skin cancer scar. And I've got really bad um, sun damage on my legs because I got second degree burns 20, about 27 years ago um, in Colorado and on my legs. And so I have tons of scarring and um, it just looks like old lady legs. Um, and so I put the castor oil all up and down my legs and, um, I'm loving the feeling on my skin. It was sticky and it did stain my pillowcase and whatnot, but I'm totally fine with that. All right. Um, Trisha says, when we move to Florida, I'm opening a wellness center. Yay. Focus on natural wellness, essential oil education. Let me know where you're moving to in Florida. We'll come visit. Um, oop, it's, I'm reading comment. Um. We need that gummy recipe in notes. Yes, we do. The news had a segment about how we don't need to take supplements. Isn't that so stupid? It, it drives me nuts when they say that. So nuts. The body was designed to repair itself. Okay, in a perfect world where we did not create a world that we're constantly poisoning and taxing our body so that it is not able to naturally um, take care of itself, right? We all have parasites, but we're eating so much processed food and unhealthy food and not farming it ourselves that we're getting tons of parasites. We're not eating the foods that naturally kill the parasites, so we have parasite overgrowth. We have so many problems. Um, we have to take supplements. We cannot get the nutrition from our food because it's been poisoned since the 1950s. It takes what, it's up to five times the amount of uh, fruits and vegetables um, you would have to eat to get the same nutrients that you did in the 50s because we are continually poisoning ourselves. We're eating the sugar, we're eating the fake sugars, we're eating the toxic sweeteners, we're still using all the toxic products. Over-the-counter supplements are garbage, you just pee them out. I've got so many good testimonials on this. I got in an Uber once. My husband and I, I think it was in Utah. My husband and I got in the Uber. And we always make friends with our Uber drivers. And this guy turned out to be, he was just Uber driving for fun. Retired to, um, what? Retired, I think it was in Salt Lake City or going to, I can't remember which. So anyway, retired. He ran a sewer plant. The number one issue at the sewer plant was supplements. Supplements were his biggest problem. Why? All the over-the-counter garbage supplements, people are literally pooping them out and ruining his sewer plant. <laughs> they clog up everything and it, it's a huge mess. He said, whatever you do, don't take over-the-counter supplements. They destroy sewer, sewer systems and sewer plants, right? He sees it firsthand. I said, that's hilarious. I said that we are going to this convention he knew about doTERRA. He's like, yeah, only take high-quality supplements that your body can absorb. Um, otherwise, you're destroying your water systems and water plants and sewer plants, right? How funny is that? Okay, so, so much it, it just is so irritating um, that people say that and then they whip out their 20 prescriptions. I haven't been on a prescription in 10 years. I was on 13. Um, natural health and wellness is the only way to go. Recently, something came up. I can't remember what. And I did it all naturally. And I was so proud of myself. I got cellulitis in April. 
took care of it naturally. Um, I have learned about so many products like castor oil and diatomaceous earth and activated charcoal and apple cider vinegar and folks just google oils don't have to be the answer to everything just google natural options for and look up your situation right there are literally facebook groups for everything i don't care what your challenge is if you want natural options my friend Vera is launching. Um, she has treated herself naturally and with traditional Western medicine for three different bouts of cancer. One of them, it was um, prognosis. Normally, prognosis is like four weeks to live, and it is, um, is it two years later? And um, she's getting ready to launch her website and Facebook group. Can't wait to support her. She's had brain cancer, breast cancer, and then another round of, um, I can't remember what else, another round of breast cancer, something like that. All right, so Google. Google's amazing, right? They keep trying to block in Facebook groups and online natural options, right? There are natural... Um, options for um, there's something called black salve and they've done everything they can because it works for the big C um, they've done everything they can um, to block it from people being able to buy it and take care of themselves naturally right it's insane all right I still haven't seen the post so I'll post the new month promos um, shortly as soon as I get them and we have a hundred percent confirmation on that um, I will not be going live in Lisa Zimmer Essential Oils Biz Tips every week. That's my Facebook group for business builders. Um, it's too much on my plate, especially for the summer with my son home. I'll go live once a month. I'll come up with a schedule here and post that for you all. So um, those of you wanting to learn more about sharing oils and doing the business, I'll post that there. Plus, I always have WWZD um, on the books. So... We're getting ready to launch WWZD at the end of July, um, beginning of August. So I'll get that posted for you all. WWZD is what would Zimmer do as a doTERRA blue diamond to run a business and help everyone get their oils um, paid for or earn enough to supplement your income or earn enough to replace your income. Whatever your goals are, I, I teach you how to reach those goals. And I get on Zooms with you personally and privately. I think what I would love to do is start doing some Zooms on oil use um, and some collaborations with some of you that are extremely knowledgeable. So if you would have some topics that you're very passionate about with doTERRA, I would love, love, love to hear from you. So you can post in the comments um, or um, you can even private message me. So I'm looking for maybe a half a dozen people um, to do a Zoom here and there with me and collaborate and cover some topics that people are, um, they won't be posted on Facebook, they'll be private Zooms so that people can um, feel more free to uh, share their um, challenges and stories and successes. And so if that's something you're interested in, you can post in the comments or you can PM me if it's something you don't wanna post in the comments, okay? I'm excited. I love my doTERRA. I feel very confident and empowered, even though the rest of my life always seems like it's in chaos. I'm sure a lot of you can relate to that. But I feel very confident that I always have tools at my fingertips now, no matter health-wise what comes up my way. Um, I have peace of mind that I have some tools to help me for the short term, even if it's something where I need to get to the hospital for an emergency. I love that I have my oils to help keep me calm, and um, I love that I have my oils to help me feel uh, confident in recovery, whatever the case may be, right? I'm going to continue working on tweaking my budget as the economy is how it is, uh, my expenses in Florida uh, doubled since moving here. And um, the one thing I'm always going to work on is making sure that I can get my doTERRA. So I hope you work on that as well. All right, I'll post the promos as soon as I find out about them. I hope you guys have an amazing day. Thanks for joining me. Have, have a great one. Happy oiling. See you next week.